chat a little about the MPH program. Uh, in case you haven't noticed, uh, our society is overwhelmed with public health challenges. Uh, Obamacare, Affordable Care Act, Accountable Care Organization. The future of the profession of optometry over the last 40 years has been really driven by the changes in public health. The future are going to be even more dependent on all the policy changes and the critical legislative changes facing us. The MPH program gives you a platform for engaging and making an impact. Hi, how you doing? My name is James Diem and I'm a recent graduate of the Pennsylvania College of Optometry Optometry Program and also the Masters in Public Health Program. I'm actually the first student to uh, graduate with a dual degree uh, at the same time. So I wanted to tell you a little bit today about you know what that has done for me and why I did it. And, you know, the reason I did it is because I really fell in love with uh, advocacy as far as optometry is related. We've come a, a long way as a profession from just glasses and contacts to now laser procedures in some uh, states and minor surgical procedures and glaucoma treatment and oral uh, medications. Uh, I, I wanted to push the that envelope forward and, and keep advocating for our profession and make sure that we're able to provide the care that I know we all learn in school and, and practice to the highest extent of our scope. And to do that, I, I knew and was told uh, by the program director of the Master in Public Health program at South that I had to learn the language of public health. And to do that, um, I had this opportunity to take this online course at uh, South University while I was also getting my OD degree. So that's really just given me an amazing opportunity to look Look at things a little bit different. Have a, an increased literacy in uh, healthcare advocacy and uh, advocating for specifically optometry and ultimately our patients. Um, so, how has that been a change for me now that I've been graduated? Well, um, since I've graduated, I've been able to tell uh, potential employers, uh, organized optometry. Um, also industry, how my specific skill set is tailored to not only working at the individual patient in front of me, but communities and uh, different groups, large groups of people, telling them about healthcare changes, um, prevention, and things of that nature that are just ultimately going to be very important for um, healthcare as, as we go down the line. So um, it, it's made a big change already. People look at me a little bit different because I have that additional credential. I have an additional skill set to offer them. And uh, for me, that's been really beneficial. Hi, my name is Lila Liang. I'm actually a third year student at PCO Salas. I'm currently at the OD MPH program. So I just want to talk to you about it. So coming from undergrad and going to optometry school right now, I know first year was really hard for me. So I actually waited until second year to start. And the school knows our curriculum, it's very demanding. So it definitely works together. So what I have done is I, I mapped out all the courses that I will be taking for the next two years. And I really strategically placed my courses around my boards, and since I'm from Canada, I'll be taking five boards in total. So I really mapped it out and then make sure I can graduate on time. And that's one of the good things about the program, it's very, very flexible. It's up to you when you want to do what, and it's at your own pace. So I highly recommend to people who are working or if you are in school right now, the program is designed for specifically for underrepresented healthcare professional, which is us. And I think there's so much more we can do about it. I'm getting the training and the tools to, uh, to expand on it, and I can't wait to do everything I can do with it. As an optometry student, I know the questions on your mind. Do I have the time, and do I have the money? We've structured our program so that we offer all AOSA students uh, a significant $10,000 scholarship. You can look at financial aid options to increase that at home institution. We will transfer some credits in. And very importantly, the program is designed totally online. It is flexible. You have up to five years to finish the program. So it gives you all the flexibility so you can balance the very important work in your core doctor of optometry program with this other program that will give you the career options to go out and make changes.